As the days go on and with the continuing harassment experienced by our Coast Guard, the Philippines is gaining more allies. One of the most recent to openly throw support to the country regarding the territorial dispute with China is Canada that has long been one of the nation's most trusted allies. Luisa Erispe has more. The great nation of Canada has pledged its unwavering support to the Philippines during the launching of Friendship Week 2023. Canadian Ambassador to the Philippines David Hartman said there has been a long-standing good relationship between Canada and Philippines. That's why there is no doubt Canada supports the country in a territorial dispute in the West Philippine Sea. The embassy also condemns the acts of China, including the recent collision between China's Coast Guard and the Philippine Coast Guard vessel of Ayungin Shoal during a rotational and resupply mission yesterday. Unfortunately, given the series of events that have taken place over the last number of months, a pretty, pretty clear, pretty vocal. Uh, we have been right at the forefront, I think, in the defense of the Philippines' sovereignty, of your territorial interests, and of your rights, uh, and we will continue to do so. On the plans of the Philippines to file a case against China with the Arbitral Tribunal for Environmental Damages, Canada believes the Philippines deserves to have jurisdiction on its territorial waters, as provided or cited in the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea or UNCLOS. It is of paramount importance to Canada to defend our, our partners, our friends and our allies in defense of your sovereignty. Uh, Canada, like the Philippines, is a country that is bound by and respects vehemently, assiduously, the rules-based international order. Uh, we've been clear about that, our stance is clear, uh, and we will be prepared uh, to do whatever is necessary uh, to help support our friends here in the Philippines. Previously, Canada signed an agreement with the Philippines giving us the opportunity to use the dark vessel detection system. This will allow the Coast Guard to monitor vessels without its automatic identification system, which is what China has been doing within our territorial waters to avoid detection by the Philippine Coast Guard. Meanwhile, Canada's support doesn't end with the West Philippine Sea. During Friendship Week, Canada announced it will be opening more construction and mechanical jobs to Filipinos. Also, they will work hand-in-hand -hand with the Department of Migrant Workers to stop illegal recruitment in Canada. Marami tayo nakikita online no? na mga recruitment, activities, mga kamp uh, kampanya tungkol sa pagpunta sa Canada. No? At marami rin tayong natatanggap ng mga reklamo, mga complaints mula sa ating mga kababayan. Ito ang opportunity upang ang ating mga kababayan, hindi lamang sa Pilipinas kundi all over the world, ay magkaroon ng access sa tamang information patungkol sa tamang way ng pagpunta sa Canada. Luisa Erispe for the Nation.